note and I'll grab the note first. Alright. Run. Alright, doesn't seem like a it's coming. Don't be out here. Please tell me I got everything I need. But I don't care, I'm hauling ass. Oh god, please tell me I got everything I need out of that room. There's nothing in here. <coughs> I'm not feeling too confident about this. But I have my inventory. Oh, well that's a healing item. What? 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 Don't scare me, Daniel. You neither. Alright. Um. Uh. Please tell me I have everything I need. Gotta be fucking me. Oh, you shut your damn fucking face. Alright, there's only one place this could they can be. Oh, are you are, are you fucking shitting me? Are, 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 are you fucking shitting me? No! Fuck! That didn't even hit me. It landed like right in front of my dick. Daniel. Oh god. Daniel. Get up. Alright, good, Daniel. I really like this damn candle because apparently the wind knocked it out. Is there any more oil? There was some, for some weird reason. Alright. Unbarricade the door. Although I do say this is probably the safest area in the game right now. Well, in this whole area at least. <laughs> Would you get it? Uh, that's good enough. And now it's on the whole ass. Alright, I'm just gonna cut straight out to when I get in front of those damn beakers unless something happens. On the way. Oh fuck. Okay, run. Ow! Run. Alright. No cutting out. Just running. Walking. Loading. Dying. Oh, fuck. 
I have a horrible headache now. And Daniel, I swear to God, if you start talk, fucking talking about things behind us again. <sighs> Alright, so what I gotta do... No, that's not it. What am I doing? Yes, I have the four different chemicals. Alright, that's how I do it. Stop it. I have a pot of apparently acid. Don't fucking mess with me or I'll burn your melted face off. Daniel. No oh, fuck, what's this? Mentos. Stairs have cold. Really? But. I, I, I can jump that. You can jump that, Daniel. Alright, no, you can't. Fuck you, then. Um, this seemed to have separated a little. I'll just grab this box. Because I know you can fucking jump this, Daniel. Yeah, see? Alright, more of these things at hand than I was expecting that. Oh. Fuck. There's more of it now. Wait. A few cuts and bruises. Head is pounding, head and hands are shaking. Alright. Refinery. Oh, fuck me. Alright, what the hell did you just write down, Daniel? Yeah, I think we already found that out. Oh god, please don't tell me this is the water area from... Oh god. Oh dear god, I think this is the water area from the demo. The word refinery just seems fucking... Uh... It sure is dark in here. Yes, and there's a good reason for it. But you can light the lamp now if you wish. What's the reason for the darkness, that is? Stay close. Be careful not to stray. What's the reason? Why is it so dark? Pay attention, Dandel. It's important that you keep going straight and make sure not to stray. Oh fuck! Please don't see me! <sighs> Fucking hell! Okay, that wasn't blood, it was wine. Stop that. But he went that way, so I'm going this way. Lantern oil. I fucking need this. Not right now, though, but... What? 
stop that. Twenty second of June, eighteen thirty nine. It's been more than a month since my last entry. After the event inside the underground chamber in Algeria, Professor Herbert insisted I return to England. He said he didn't want to risk forfeiting the entire expedition lest I took a turn for the worse. An excessive decision, in retrospect. But I'm glad it turned out that way. I found my journal this morning in the haphazard collection of things brought home from Africa. Next to it lay the broken stone orb wrapped in cloth. I tried to assemble it, but couldn't. The pieces wouldn't fit together, as if they weren't from the same object. Could I have imagined it all? Was there ever a complete war? Fuck. Some weird crack in the ceiling with light emanating out of it. Tinderbox. Give me that thing. Oh. Uh. Alright, fuck the hole. What's over here? Wait, Tinder. this journal, even though it was intended for my journey to Africa. This must be something very important. I just know it. I've taken it upon myself to piece the orb back together, but it's been more difficult than one might think. The pieces are behaving strangely. They seem to change color, shape, and texture, but ever so slightly. Yesterday, I took careful measurements and notated any significant markings. Today, I confirmed my suspicions. They were changing. I was terrified and rushed off to see the finest geologist in London, Sir William Smith. I approached the subject with care and we discussed how rocks change form. He told me about the nature of glass, how it eventually collapses on itself like ice slowly melting over the course of centuries. Smith eased my mind a bit, but I can't escape the feeling that these shards have otherworldly properties. No fucking boy. <sighs> Give me my damn tinder box. Yeah, that's just back out where the... Wait. Have I been here? Alright, yeah, I've been here. Stop that. I'm already freaked out enough as it is. I don't need you helping more. Of course it'd be locked, wouldn't it? Does that something scary jump out at me as soon as I walk through here? How's my sand? Okay, I can see now. Lantern oil. I know I probably shouldn't spam it, but oh well. Alright, so a door. That's too heavy to lift by hand. Right, you can stop crawling around on the ground now, Daniel. It's not manly. Uh, since there's a tinder in there. Alright, so... Everything's red. I don't want to open that. Alright, so there's some... 
something clocking it. What if he buys a stick by chance? Cool. Aw, oh, it disintegrated. Spin, 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 spin. Please don't have anything come up out of it. It's the last thing I want to happen. Alright, fuck this, I'm running. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. Cellar archives. You know what? After this loading screen, this is where I'm gonna end the video for now. I'll be back sometime later to... Okay, yeah, I'm definitely gonna end the fucking video here. I will be back sometime later when I don't have a raging headache and I'm not scared out of my fucking mind. Until then, goodbye viewers. Oh, fuck.